Well, good start to the day. Absolutely amazing day, real blue sky day. I was going to head out to the mountains, however, uh, we had about eight inches, maybe six inches of really wet, heavy snow on top of some already wet, heavy, yucky snow. It's any trouble this time of the year. It's, uh, everything on the south side of the hills is kind of squished and everything on the north side of the hills is just bloody rock solid still. So I will uh, do a walk around town. I have my litter picking stuff with me today, so I'm going to pick up some litter on the way around. And uh, I'm going to head down that way somewhere. Preferably into the sunshine because it's still a little chilly. I think it's minus four when I looked on my thing this morning. So uh, I will head down that way and do some more later. Well, I have my litter picking stuff with me. However, <laughs> this wind is pain in the rear end. So I will save that picture for one of my fences. And head on down this way. There is some litter down on this corner. I'll grab that on the way by. But and we'll go from there. Well, heading down across Centre Street Bridge. It's a really nice sunny day. Come on that. So we'll take that any day of the week. Yeah. It'll be a nice blue sky day. I think I'm going to head down that way, I think, and see what I can find down there. Oh, amazing day downtown. Look at this. Isn't this nice and sunny? I'll take this every day of the week. Yeah. <laughs> this is very nice indeed. Right. I'm going to carry on down towards Inglewood, I think. Let's see what I can find out. Alright, this is the site of Fort Calgary. This is the, uh, the original settlement points in Calgary. And this long straight piece in front of me was one of the original railway tracks, believe it or not. It used to go straight down across there and across the river. This is Fort Calgary up in here. Just picking up some litter in here. And, uh, there's not actually that much up in here, which is good. This time of the year when all the snow melts, this is when you find all the stuff that's been buried in the snow all winter so this is a good time of the year to come and pick up litter right so that is downtown Calgary Calgary Towers over there you can still just about see it at one point it was the tallest building in Calgary as you can see it currently isn't <laughs> not by a long shot and uh, yeah I'm going to continue on down through the try to get out of this wind picking up litter is a pain in the rear end when there's a lot of wind so I will uh, head on down this way and pick up these little bits here and head on back into Inga. Nice to see this area being used again. This used to be all full of veggies and what have you. Some of my early pictures you'll see it's full of vegetables and things. It's nice to see that all still being used. Looks like they built new gardens and that in there, which is great. That's, uh, that was the plan. Yeah. Just got a picture from this corner. I'll come back and pick up. I just spotted some litter there. I have to do this picture from this corner. I've done this one a few times in the past. I will do it again with its new beginnings, new fence. Excellent. Right, we just go and grab those bits of litter and I should be on my way. All right, come down to the what I call the new 12th Street Bridge. And as you can see, the river is uh, flowing pretty good. It's still dangerous, don't ever head out on the ice because it's quite often undercut this time of the year. But, uh, I will head across to the zoo side and up along there and see how good that is. What a lovely day, a bit of a chill. I should have put a little jacket on or something, but it, uh, it's certainly not bad. Right, I'm going to head on around that one. Right. What a lovely day. Head up into the park, there's a park over there on the right hand side. Gonna head up through there. There used to be quite a lot of garbage along that row of trees on the side there between the, the park and the, the river. But, uh, so this time of the year, once all the snow melts, there you can see all the garbage. So it's definitely a really good time of the year to pick it up. So, right, on I go. Downtown Calgary. They've got part of the pathway closed along there, looks like they're doing part of the flood defence. Um, pumping station or something along there, but look at it. And down through here actually doesn't look too bad. There's quite often a lot of garbage down through here. But I've only got about half a bag so far, so it's actually good. Alright. Let's head on. No, we have to do this picture. <laughs> Not that I've done this picture a few times, but I'm going to do it again. Yeah, this is a very nice bridge. This is how you build bridges. 
very nice. This piece up in here should be fairly clean. For the most part, the city is a very clean place. People often comment on when they see my pictures what an amazingly clean place Calgary is. And it is really. But this time of the year, it's when you find all the stuff coming out in the snow. It's not a bad idea to wander around and grab some. It's a very cool tree. Yeah. Right, there's a long pathway through the middle here. And it has a little fence on the side of it. And that does tend to catch the garbage so I might head up that way. Some guys down here for me. Yeah. Right. Let me head up through the park and see what I can find. Right. Head up over the bridge. We can find. Right. Yeah, I can go left or right here. I've been down that side, and I saw that other chap down there collecting litter. So I might just go down over this side. Just do a before we go. Yes, we just went down that area down there. It's all pretty clean. It's good. Right. This wind is actually pretty chilly. I'm trying to put a little jacket on. Yeah. Time for me to go. I am going to go this way. Good day garbage cleaning. Unfortunately my garbage bag decided to end up in a big hole in the bottom. I had to pick up some glass, a lot of broken glass, and it uh, unfortunately cut the bottom of the bag. So that kind of cut my day short because I only had one bag with me. Right. Now I've got to head back up this hill. This is a bit of a slog up this hill. So uh, but it is a good spot for pictures. So I will do that. I will head up here. This road down the bottom here, this is Memorial Drive. I actually find it nicer to walk up here than up the other side. This is softer on the feet. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know where this log came from. Every time I see this log, I think I should collect this and keep it as firewood. Because that's actually a really nice piece of dry wood now. <laughs> I can't walk past a piece of wood without thinking, hey, that ain't no firewood. So, I will head on up the city, up the hill here. Wish I had another bag with me now, because I keep seeing garbage. But I only have one bag. Which is a pain. I should have bought more bags. That was uh, bad planning on my part, I think. Yeah. There's so much garbage up this big. I'll have to uh, remember that for the next. What's that? There's garbage here. Yeah. Yes. Right. Oh. Doesn't matter where I go. It always involves going uphill somewhere. What a fantastic blue sky day. 
I was just talking to a guy who's a photographer and uh, he was going to head out the mountains he says it's crazy windy out there at the moment and the, the wind I'm taking this way back up the hill because this is actually less windy this is not the hill I want to be going up however it is way less windy than the other one so I will go this way for now I will head up the hill and do some more when I get to the top right that'll do for the moment this piece is always a good view of the city get some nice photos from up here done these pictures a few times there's a nice little round tree just up here this one here when this leaf's out and it's all covered in berries it's actually a really good shot that's a good picture of the city from here especially when it's all green it's greening up nicely now so. right. up the hill I go right battery swapped out we'll continue on my way it's this time of the year you can actually see the city through the trees once it all leaves out, which won't be very long, it, uh, you can't see much of that. <laughs> Not a bad view though. Huh? How old's that? Very nice. Nice enough to have a fresh battery. Right. I think I will call that it for this one. I will head on up the hill, up over the other hill, and uh, then I'm going to head on home. Right, thanks for coming along.